Hi, I'm Moy, and today I'm going to show you this fancy customized product. Let's get started. At first, the eyes might not be sized perfectly for your avatar, so let us fix that. You can use the sliders to adjust the position and size until it's looking good. Here we have presets where you can save and load them by clicking on the various eyes. At the top right of the HUD, there's the Customize tab. Here we have the various parts that you can customize. For example, clicking on the arrows cycles through the various textures for that part. If you do not wish to use a pose stand, you can click on the avatar icon to go into edit appearance so your avatar isn't flailing all about because of how cool your new eyes are. The sun icon toggles the full bright of the shine detail. The box icons toggle the various parts on or off. And if you want to change its color, that's simple too. Click on the color wheel. This will pop up in the familiar looking color picker, and from here you can click and drag your mouse to select the desired tint. Don't forget to press accept. To get a better look at the crowd admiring your fancy new eyes, you can click on the customize tab eyeball to move them all about. You can press the L and R toggle buttons to customize just a single eye if so desired, useful for making funny faces, and of course changing the color or features of just a single eye. After you're done making your extravagant eyes, be sure to save them for further use. You can do this by simply going back to the Presets tab, clicking on the handy Save button, and choosing a slot to store them in. This concludes the product demonstration. If you have any questions about this fine product, feel free to ask me, Moy Loon in Second Life, or if you wish to buy or try these fine eyes, click on the links in the video description.